Hello guys, my name is JP. Come one, come all. It's finally back after probably over a year by now. Plague Inc. It's on PC now. This is the Steam Early Access. You can buy it right now. It's It has like nothing on it though, so all you can do is play the main game. So we will do that. We will We'll start from the beginning. We'll start with bacteria. I think I know what I'm doing. I don't even have anything of these. Uh, let's just... Ooh, brutal is what you need to unlock the next things, I believe, though. Let's just make sure this works the same first. So let's do a casual. PAX 12? That sounds familiar. PAX East? I don't know, it's a bad joke. Welcome to Plague Inc. You are a new bacteria. To win, you must evolve and spread across the world, wiping out all humans in the ultimate plague. Very well. Uh, I'm gonna go with my usual. Yeah. You start as something big and. usually. you know, in the Eastern world, this whole. The Eastern Hemisphere, that usually makes it easier, because everything's connected, pretty much. So let's go with China today. Pop the bubble. So far, it's looking very good. Uh, it's... Yeah, this is not bad. The interface is definitely... Fancy. Like, it's, it's taking a second to get used to this. this the absolute first time I have started this up. How much? How much am I gonna need for air or water? Nine points. Okay. Let's play it like double speed for now. Okay. Pop bubbles. That's same as always. Infected ten people. Twelve. Fourteen. 15, 16, 18. Okay, I'm not gonna try to keep up with that. That's <laughs> especially fast forwarding. Alright. I'm going to go ahead and add air transmission. Do we have it? No. Where is it? Did I buy it? There it goes. I could have sworn I clicked that. What is this? This is, whoa. Apparently the stats for the entire world. That is very fancy. Let's get back to it. They should start infecting a little bit faster now. What would happen in real life? Plan a strategy and evolve your disease accordingly to by spending DNA points. Yes, I've done that. Come on, guys, I have played the game before. Oh, the zoom in is very nice. Yeah, that's pretty sweet. I prefer the whole world view, though. That looks, looks pretty good. Pop bubbles. Yep, I see it here. Mm hmm. Business as usual. That's good for me. Now, if it says that at the end, when they're all dying from it, that's when we know the game is bugged. Uh, let's go ahead with water transmission. I'm going to play my same old strategy. It's been a while since I've played Plague Inc. at all. But I'm going to see if my old strategy still works. The slow and steady kind of deal. It's doing pretty good. Looks like the trick to actually winning... Not necessarily speed or high score. The trick to finishing and winning is uh, going undetected for as long as possible. And in my case, I usually stay undetected until I want to kill, so that's the way I'm going to play it. Alright, transmission. Which one severity is the one that Let's them know what's up, right? 
I want air two. Or do I want to go with an ability? Uh, you, I usually I'm gonna need these eventually, anyways. But bacteria, the simplest one to do it is uh, just do the bacterial resist resilience. It gives the effect of both of these off the start, so I'll just go with that. Mm, I have 12 more. I guess I'll go level 2. That's enough to at least get in on every country. Uh, I think I need at least level 3 to fully infect all the countries, though. Like, you know, I always have, all in my old ones, I always had problems with area around the Sahara and Greenland and stuff like that. They would usually catch on pretty quick. Not that they caught on pretty quick, it's just, it's really hard to get in there. Because there's very low, po very low population with very low population density. Korean border guards plan strike. 50,000 border guards starting to strike and disrupt traffic in the former military zone due to poor employment prospects. Uh, that's pretty much real life. What is up with North Korea, man? They're nuts over there. It's like, oh, let's start something today. What are we going to start today? Oh, let's try to start a nuclear war. Okay. With Japan. <laughs> okay, it's even weirder. Does Japan even have nukes? I mean, I know there was a lot of... They got kind of screwed after World War II, like, as far as armaments. We weren't allowing them to have anything. But why am I talking about this? This, this has nothing to do with anything. <laughs> I don't know why he started going on that. Okay, humid countries are getting more humid. That's... I guess. I'm just waiting on the bubbles. Now let's check the stats for the world here. Got a good area so far. I'd like to have India. They have a very high population too. Let's see, India has almost as many people as as China, realistically, over a much more dense area. There you go. That's what I wanted. That's already an extra billion people. That's like half the world right here. This is one. This is like two billion, and this is like a million, and a billion and a half. So that's about half the population of the world, just right there. I'm pretty much set at this point. I just need them to hit a plane or a boat. Yeah, and they've already. Yep, they're doing it. That's what I figured. That's why you go to the super high dip, uh, population density places, China and India, and get the rest of the world like nothing. Has infected more purple... purple? Purple? Has infected more people in the world than HIV. It's an extremely infectious disease. Yeah... That's a lot of people. Ah, oh, this is that point. It's gonna explode on me. I think it's easier now. I mean, I know it's on casual, but this seems way easier. Probably to increase the replay value of it since it's a computer game. With a mobile game, it's something you kind of take your time with and you just kind of play it when you want to. With a PC game, you sit here and you play it specifically, so you gotta kind of make it playable, I guess? Not that regular play game wasn't playable, it's just. Now it's. Well, it's definitely easier. Alright, let's check my points. I don't believe this one normally mutates extra symptoms. So I don't have to worry about selling those off. Uh, it seems to be infecting pretty well, so... I don't really need to spend anything, I don't think. Uh, I guess I can increase the... infectivity a bit. Go level 2 on both of those. I should speed things up a bit. Yeah, we're getting 
like a million, hundred million at a time now. No problem. Piece of cake. Of course, I'm pretty sure you have to beat everything on Brutal to unlock stuff. But like I said, this first time is just to get the feel of the game again. It's been a very long time since I've played. Like, I know I have it on my iPad, but I, my iPad's for work. I usually use it for work stuff. But yes, look for this on Steam. It is... I don't remember. I don't remember how much I paid for it, honestly. <laughs> I saw it on here I was like, yep, it's mine. Okay, coughing symptoms. Uh, we do not want symptoms. Not yet. We don't want anyone catching on too soon. Although we do have both sections of the world now. So it's just a matter of time here. See, it's hitting all the little European countries. Now it's hitting all the Southern South American countries. Central America. But yeah, I saw this on Steam. I was like, yeah, I'm getting that. I have to. I'll be the first person to admit the biggest videos on my on my channel are more infectious than the common cold. Hmm. What's the next step of that? More, more infectious than the flu? I don't know. <laughs> Oh, too many bubbles. I can't pop them all. I keep wanting to tap my screen. I keep wanting to, like, poke at my TV to, to pop the bubbles, because I'm so used to that. But yeah, the biggest thing on my channel is the Plague Inc. videos. The three. The regular one, the Necrovirus, and the Nurax Worm. And people, the comments are like, half the time, they're like, more, can we see more? I'm like, well, I can't record on my iPad anymore. There is still no jailbreak for iOS 7, so upgrading was a massive mistake. Look at this hole, oh, this is scary looking. What's left? Oh wow, there's not a lot of places left. Uh, I might need to go with... Level 3 here. Yeah, for 11 points. No problem. That should get in all the other climates. <laughs> We've already got one of the hardest ones, Greenland. Do we have Madagascar? Yes, we even have Madagascar, so... We've got the easiest one, the hardest ones. It's just a matter of time. I wasn't sure if it had Madagascar, because it wasn't... Normally is a dotted line, and that's the only way to get in there. Wow, that thing's still giving me points. Oh no. Nobody needs to be having a rash today. No thank you. Very itchy. I get I feel itchy just thinking about it. it a disease that only makes you itchy. We're doing pretty good. We're most of the way to there. Caribbean, West Africa, and Morocco. Morocco's the one I have a problem with. It's like right up in here. It's here somewhere. Where is it? Oh. There it is. It's the opposite of the Strait of Gibraltar. How could they have so much of that coast? That seems kind of screwy. But yeah, that they've... Oh, there's a bunch of stuff. That's the Caribbean and West Africa. Uh, Morocco, and what else is left? I to click out. I click back in. Just Morocco. Morocco is the one I always have a problem with. I, it must be, like, ridiculously hot and humid there again, I guess. Everything seems good, right? Yeah, they're fine. <laughs> so that's the last red bubble I'm waiting for. Once I want to see that. I can start planning for the attack. The final attack. We're doing really good. Like I said, on casual, it seems pretty ridiculously easy. Those dead are not my fault. They are the fault of the earthquake. 
Somebody mentioned that once because I always said that nobody dies when I'm making my virus or whatever. Uh, we don't do this. What's we'll assist? I don't want to know. Painful lumps containing pockets of pathogen. Slight chance of bursting, which can spread the disease. Mm, no, not right now. Uh, what was it? Somebody commented on one of the old videos that that I, I'm stupid for saying that nobody died when there was dead people. The virus did not kill them. It was the natural disaster. I keep lethality completely down until the end. Like the second. I have 100% of the world infected. I will start killing them mercilessly. London Olympics mystery. Why does it... Is that a thing? Didn't we already have the London, London Olympics? Right? I don't remember. I don't keep track of the Olympics. I don't much care for it. It's, eh, it's not that great. I don't know. Here, I've solved the problem with Russia and you and the Ukraine. Just wipe them all out. Wipe everybody out. No, no political problems if there's nobody left alive. You know, that's what I say, and if you watch The Walking Dead, man, those people are messed up. Oh, man, this past Sunday's episode. Jesus Christ. If you haven't seen it, don't bother going to see it. You're gonna you're gonna cry or something. It was that bad. It was supposedly the I don't want to say worse because that can be taken the wrong way, but the most brutal episode of The Walking Dead so far. And that's saying a lot because it's like four seasons in. Severe storm strike Turkey. Gobble gobble. It's fine. How many people in the world are there? Mm, so same as before. It hadn't changed that. You think they would? I'm pretty sure we have about seven billion people on the planet now. Oh, there's assists again. Uh, no, thank you. That sounds pretty gross. So the cost to devolve isn't going up. So that's. I don't know if that's a perk of it playing on casual or. Or if it's just... doesn't go up for bacteria. I think it only goes up for viruses. Because this is a bacteria that I am playing as. So we have 157 points. A lot of points. 62? Ah, that's a lot of points, man. So which route do we want to go? Uh, remember, depending on what you unlock, it goes a certain way. I think over here is Necrosis, which is pretty cool. Basically, dissolves you. Like, you decay while you're alive. I guess we'll see. I definitely have enough points to buy everything. You can just drop down the news feed. It pauses it for that. That's a little bit annoying. We almost have them. Rounding up the last millions of people. See, it's amazing how... There, see, the last... No healthy people left. They don't even realize that they've all been infected. Like, normally when I do this, they'll at least be like, Well, we know something's there, but we won't do anything about it. This time, they just don't even know. So I'm guessing the severity and lethality are what they keep track of. Uh, so let's go with symptoms. Let's go cough. Sneezing. Immune suppression. That's gonna suck. Total organ failure. That's a pretty good one. Coma. Let's go up here. Is it... I'm gonna go up to rash. Sweating. Skin lesions. Yeah, this is necrosis. Yep. That's pretty... Hemorrhagic shock would have been really good. That is... You basically bleed from the inside out. Non-stop. And we're out of points. 
needs to evolve to kill. Trust me, it'll kill. Give it a second. This thing is just going to just wipe out billions of people in a couple of seconds. New, <laughs> new worrying disease spreading. They're just now catching on. After about a year of it. First death in the Middle East. You guys are gone, man. It's too late. Now that they're working on the cure, though. 1%. Shut down airports again. Too late. Everything is too late. They're losing tens of millions of people at a time. And then he just starts working on a cure? Really? <laughs> Not the first place I'd think. We've wiped out more than the Black Death. Not bad. Nausea. <laughs> That's gonna make everything worse. Actually, the addition of more symptoms uh, makes it that much harder for them to kill. Or for them to cure. So that's actually not bad. Yeah, everything is pretty much gone. Killed more than smallpox. That's. I know smallpox was that bad. We're still getting points. I might as well keep evolving this thing. Uh, pulmonary fibrosis? Nah, that's. Inflammation? Sure, why not? I wasn't paying attention. I don't know if it brought it down a little or not. It should have. <laughs> Getting points like crazy, though, actually. I can just keep adding more symptoms. Okay, this time it was at like 10%. Seizures. Wow. I know the more you increase the severity, the harder it comes to cure. We've wiped out about a third of the population. Oh, I take that back. About half of the population. It's too fast. And there's nobody left in some places, I believe. Let's see. You say? Close to anarchy. That's interesting. Look at this crazy graph. Your requirement, your research. Oh, it's so tiny, it just shot up. It's not even giving me a proper graph for that. Because it just happened so suddenly. Yeah, Libya just stopped existing. <laughs> That's good. That's what they get for killing Doc Brown. That plane! Why do you still have planes? This is pretty bad. Getting about a hundred million in every every little tick of time. Almost over. Well, it's slowing down because there's less people, but... Hey, look, Bubble. Let's go see how much farther I can take this. Insanity! I've gone insane in the membrane. That's pretty bad. Look at the severity on this thing. I do not want this. Ever. I, it'd be nice if it, like, told you... If it showed you in that little picture what specifically is infected. Yeah, these last couple hundred million people left on Earth are having, like, the worst time of their lives right now. They've all gone insane, and... Ugh. And just die. They're, they're crazy people just dying everywhere. It might as well be a zombie virus. It's not over with. I don't know what this little... I think it's just a little animation. It doesn't really mean anything. This is... wow. <clears throat> yeah, we're pretty much done here. We're down to about the last million people at this point. Watch, there's gonna be one person who developed natural immunity. I'm surprised it's not a thing. There should at least be occasions where people can develop natural immunities, because that's what would happen in real life. 
<clears throat> it's pretty unrealistic that a single virus uh, without severe mutation halfway through would just kill all human life. There's always somebody that's immune to something. World destroyed. Terracite gene type and virus plague type have been discovered and unlocked. So apparently I don't need to play Brutal to unlock everything. That would be the expansion stuff. Alright, so let's check my stuff. 608 days. They only got 16% of the cure. Genetic complexity? Complex? I guess. And I had a total score of... 9,030. Well, a three-bar thing. So... Not bad. So that'll do it for today, but thank you for watching. My name is JP, and I will see you next time. That's right, next time, now that I can keep playing it. With more Plague Inc., I will go through all of the virus types. Thanks for watching.